just spoke with Wayne Cusey, the builder of this model, and John is the donor mm -hmm. who had it commissioned for him and is donating to us. And thank you so much for this generous gift. It's, we are really super excited to have it and I'm glad to be here meeting you and meeting the artists and having this opportunity. Um, mm -hmm. Now, I understand you're from the area. Could you tell us a little bit about yourself? Where are you from? And, and what's your relation with the SS United States? My name is John, um, to put it uh, bluntly and straightforward. I love big ships. I love big moving metal objects such as trains and planes and submarines and such. And to me, the SS United States is the best one of the bunch. Yeah. And I was, uh, I come from uh, Darby, but I lived most of my childhood growing up in uh, Glen Riddle. That's Delaware and, County, right? Yeah, Delaware County. Awesome. And um, because I live so close to the ship, I have uh, an opportunity that I'm very grateful for to go and see her on a regular basis when I'm having free time or, you know, so just, I like to go up to the ship, sit mm -hmm. on the grass across the uh, Delaware Avenue and just gaze at her as long as my attention span will let me. Yeah, something that all, all Philadelphians, you know, share, being able to, to see it whenever mm -hmm. we're over there. Um, and we're so glad to have you as a supporter, John. Thank you. Um, now, how long have you been a ship enthusiast? And, and do you think, is there one particular moment or anything that sort of really sparked that passion? Um, I've been a ship enthusiast basically as far back as my memory will take me. I've been watching documentaries. My mom would set me up with documentaries and my father literally as, back as, as far back as two and a half years old. And I just soaked it all up. And um, what, I really, what sparked the interest in the SS United States was the Titanic. But as soon as we got internet, um, I learned about the SS United States while browsing the internet. And she became my new favorite and has stayed that same favorite ship, uh, not just favorite ship, but favorite man-made creation of all time that I can find on the internet. Awesome, we certainly share that, that mm -hmm. belief with you. Now, how did you learn about uh, Wayne Cusey and, and his work with the toothpick ship models? Well, a while, quite a while back, I was, uh, we had Make Magazines uh, that would come to the house and stuff. I saw his uh, RMS Queen Mary model, the 20 foot, a 25 foot uh, toothpick model in Make Magazine. At the time, I didn't think much of it simply because my, my mind was in a different place. But then later on, uh, in 2019, I was browsing YouTube and in, I was looking up Lusitania stuff. And in the related uh, video section, uh, I saw a giant toothpick model of Lusitania. I was like, okay, what is this? And I clicked on it and I was just wowed completely because I just was like, it's perfect. This, this like large construction made entirely out of toothpicks. It's, to me, it's a complete work of art. Oh yeah, and it's amazing, you know, how, how far he, he came and the resilience that, mm -hmm. that just continuing to do these things brings such, such wonderful mm -hmm. results. And to me, uh, I just wanted to own one of my favorite ships. So here she is and I'm donating it to, donating it to the Conservancy because I want to see it and the, the other people get to see it. And, you know, my hope is maybe one day if the ship is saved, uh, she can, this ship can be inside the ship, and I might go on her in New York and just say hi, you know. That would certainly be incredible. Now, uh, if you could share one message with other SS United States supporters, those interested in saving the ship and preserving its legacy, what would that message be, John? Persist in social media. If you're sitting by the bus stop, take out your phone, say, hey, check out this cool ship. Just basic communication. Try to point out the things that you think somebody else would be very interested in about. There's history. There's not just the, the ship itself, but the people who were who uh, walked her decks. Uh, famous people like presidents, movie stars, royalty, um, and many other things. For me, what really gets it is the engineering aspects mm -hmm. and the proportions and the design and everything. It's it's like uh, like I said, the perfect man-made object. And to me, the ship represents raw power incarnate. Mm -hmm. There's so much so much to love about the ship, and yeah, we like, agree, and we're, we're glad that 
your passion and Wayne's has mm -hmm. brought us here, and so glad to have the model. Thank you very much, John. You're quite welcome. It's been a pleasure.